Ah. <laughs> All right, guys. So, yes. Um, thank you guys for joining us today. Um, of course, you already know it's your girl, Megan. And today, I have a special guest with me, my nephew, Devon. Okay, yeah, my name is Devon. Yes. <laughs> please um, help me, guys, give him a warm welcome. And please, as you guys know, make sure the comments are just helpful. We're helping you, helping us. We're just discussing topics, trending topics, and at the same time, we're just getting into it, you know, relating to our lives at the same time, how we can do better. Now, with that being said, the topic we have today, guys, like, okay, some of y'all already know about this already, but Yaya Mayweather and NBA Youngboy, some of y'all already know about this, but... You heard when you first heard about it happened in April, right? I think mm -hmm. in April. April. Yeah, we don't really know the date, so go check out the date. But basically, the story was he. No, sorry, it was NBA young boy and his baby mama or something like that, and at his house, it was his house, and Yaya Mayweather. She decided to pop up, I guess, and he she was there and. Yaya Mayweather did not like that. She's like, uh, uh I don't know why you're here, but you got to go. So, basically, I guess the girl said she wasn't leaving. She wasn't doing it. wasn't happening. Then they end up getting to an altercation to where knives were drawn. Butter knives at that. <laughs> Butter knives. Like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, you got them heads. You couldn't, you couldn't lump her up? Like, you had to, okay, okay. But she got the butter knives out. Wanted to, you know... Cross, cut her up, ends up slashing her. I think she slashed her, her arms or something, or her stomach or something like that. Mm -hmm. Cut her like a couple times or three times or something like that. It was crazy. But she ended up getting arrested, as well as NBA Youngboy. He was in um, the videos we watched. He was like, he got arrested, but he's not in trouble. Like how Yaya's in trouble. And come to find out... The girl, like his baby mama, is pregnant too. So if he, if she loses that baby, she basically, she, yeah, she basically like, killed she, someone, she basically killed, killed the mom, yeah. like an infant. Like you're going downtown, mom. but not to mention it's just like that's child endangerment. Like depending on how they draw up that, um, those. Like the documents in the case, it's, yeah. It's, 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 like, you know, there's no freaking way like that she could get off, like, and have killed the infant. Like, it's just not possible. Right, exactly. And from the research that I've like conducted, come to find out that they're going to do like the trial's going to start in August. So I'm can't wait. I'm like I'm kind of excited to see. Like I'm sorry to say, but I'm like anxious. <laughs> I'm anxious to see what's going to happen. Because it's like, that's cr a crazy situation. Like, you know, mm -hmm. like, I can't even imagine, like, one, Misa Gal never fights over man. But, you know, <laughs> but, you know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, it's like, I just don't know what she was going through. I had, like, she has it all. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm just kind of confused. Like, right. especially when you have it all. Like, you know what I'm saying? And then you just met. Like, why would you put your chances? Why would you put every anything, everything you have on the line for NBA Young Boy? Like, why? Like, what? Because he's. I don't even know what to say, like, because he's a rapper, because he got money, boom, you have money, you could rap, you were rapping, like, you were, you could have done num more numbers than him, like, I, you were, like, it just didn't make any sense to me, like, Definitely. what, why she did that, and she essentially threw her life away, like, people may want to work with her, but probably not, because you get mad, you don't want to cut a bitch, <laughs> so, yeah, like, no training, oh, no, like, come on. Like, that was super crazy. And not to mention, she's, like, she's up there. Like, I can understand if you live down a block in the projects, but you <laughs> live, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, she's living a life. Loft after loft. Like, you know what I'm saying? Jet after jet. Like, what are you doing? What are you doing? Like, <sighs> they be taking this rap thing too seriously. Especially when they not live about that life. But it's all love, you know, at the end of the day. Um... 
I really hope that she learns her lesson because even when it comes down, I can't just be like, oh, I hope yeah, yeah, she get all this. Yeah, I hope she get out of this and learn her lesson because at the same time, the girl that got cut up, she going through shit. She's going through turmoil and all that type of situation she's got to deal with now because you decided to cut her up. And not to mention, she's pregnant. So, I don't play... I don't say, oh, because she's famous, uh, I'm I'm rooting for her. No, I'm rooting for whoever's in the righteous way. So, I just pray that that girl is okay, her baby's okay. And I hope Yaya learned her lesson, like, at the end of the day. Like, that's what I really, truly believe should be the outcome of this situation. If she gotta do some time, she better do some time. You, you got all that lip. Do that time, mama. You got that lip for it, so... Do the time for it, you know what I'm saying? That's what that's what the real streets is about. You do shit, you gotta pay for it. So um, that's the way the cookie crumbles. So yeah, do you have anything else to say about this situation with yeah, yeah, and, and NBA? I just feel like it was dumb. Like <laughs> it, honestly, it, I just feel like it was dumb. How you how y'all go from fighting over him to grabbing a butter knife and stabbing up a pregnant like woman? Like I don't I don't understand. And then the fact that he's like, I don't know if he's watching. I don't know what he's doing. Yeah, that was weird. But yeah, it's like, how? What kind of like, like, what is that? Like, what kind of trying? What is that? He That's even not, break it up. Like, exactly. Yeah. Like, and he let it get that far. And you, as a man, to have the mother of your child, and you know what I'm saying, and she's pregnant again. You know what I'm saying? To be in a, any type of physical altercation with whoever, that's a problem. It's a problem. That's a good point. So I'm, it's, it was just dumb. Like it just was taken taken out of proportion. It was blown out of proportion, literally. Like it, it didn't have to go that far, but because he just stood up there and watched, it just went that far. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. it's uh, a super crazy story. It didn't happen in a mansion, right? In his mansion. In his mansion. I think around his kids, like. He was, I've been seeing videos where he's smoking around his kids, cursing, profanity. It's just, like, crazy. The cycle continues, y'all, once again. Right. You know, we have to continue in the hood. The cycle will always continue. It's a mental thing. All right, guys. Well, I want to thank y'all so much for hanging out with us for this little bit segment segment with uh, Yaya and NBA Youngboy. And I want to thank my nephew for stopping by, um, being guests on Yes Gal. Now, let me tell you, he's going to be stopping by for a couple of, um, during this whole pandemic. So stay tuned, guys. <laughs> so he will be here. Guest star. So you can comment below, ask him questions. If you want to be like, hey, I want to follow him, check out his um, Instagram right here. Check him out. Once you check him out, make sure you come over here and check your girl out too. And yeah, just link up with us soon. His Instagram, his uh, YouTube is all going to be up and popping. So stay tuned, guys. And thank you again for watching. Yes, yeah! All right, guys. Until next time. Bye. <laughs>